Okay. I know I'm a little new to this family, but I can just sit by and watch you play these stupid games. Seriously. A baby. <gasps> okay, let's say you go through with this. Have you even considered the kind of coming in this takes? Are you going to do it naturally or artificially? Really? With a man? Okay, anyone you know? No! <laughs> so what you are saying is that you have to find some random guy who is willing to bracket on you and let you and your girlfriend raise his child. <laughs> okay. How old are you? 20? Could you at least wait until you and your girlfriend have been together for a couple of years? I mean, just to, to make sure. You're already married. Oh, <laughs> you could have said that. <laughs> are you sure about this situation? I mean, are you sure that you are a lesbian? As I recall, you had nothing but boys up until now. Well, they were not the best selection, but... I mean... Are you sure that this is not some experimental phase you are going through? No. Okay, so maybe, just maybe, you are running out of ideas on how to drive your family crazy. I know. This is what you do. Every time that we have a family get together, you drop out some ridiculous bomb just uh, so you can shock your mother. Last Christmas, you told us you joined the gang. Over Easter, you took up your top in front of the whole family just to show us your devil tattoo. And every time your mother ends up in her room crying. Trish, you need to think about this. Bringing a baby into this world is not a joke. It's not something you can do on a win and it's certainly not something you can do for shock value. Yes, you're right. You're absolutely right. I decided to go into this family, but you're not quiet. There's nothing wrong with this family except you. What about Tom, can we meet this girl? I mean, if she's going to get married into this family, maybe you could bring her around. Just to know if she can, what is that you always say? Deal with it? No? Is she even real, Trish? What a piece of work you are, really. <laughs>